Hello, so I drive a Toyota Matrix and it does not have the factory roof rack on it and I just bought one so if you'll join me in the adventure of putting this thing on because I'm always hauling stuff around and figured uh, I needed one of these especially for kayaks and PVC pipe and stuff so anyway let's get this thing on top of the roof alright let's see what's in the box here 2500 roof rack system for the Vibe and the Matrix All right, here's all the stuff that came in the box. Got the DK062, which is supposed to be the kit that works on the Matrix and the Vibe. And then it looks like the black strip that's on the uh, top here just came loose, but it just presses back in fairly easily. And we've got all these little legs here. And key locks for each one of these. Bunch of cool stuff here. Alright, the instructions are telling me to make sure this screw back here is facing out like this so you can easily screw this piece with your Allen wrench. Next, they say to take the rubber foot and one of these plastic pieces and clamp it down onto here. I guess just like that. Next it says to take the plastic and rubber base here and attach it to this which will allow it to swivel. Like that. Now it's telling me to use this black strip with the measurement markers on it and we're going to cut the front two for the Toyota, so 52 millimeters, and then the back two for the Toyota is 48 millimeters. And I guess that's going to prevent uh, water, or bugs, and stuff from getting in this strip whenever your feet are on here. I cut this at 52 millimeters, which is what it said to do. I slid this piece onto the bar. Now I'm going to take a foot and slide that onto there using that little nut in that so then I can take my allen wrench here and tighten that down I trimmed off the last of this piece and stuck the rest here on this other end so make sure your rubber piece on the top is flush and then take one of these caps and stick it into the end and make sure that this little lip here is on the top so that it'll fit this piece flush here. Okay, so the paperwork says you're supposed to take the door frame here and measure back this way for measurement A and that's 250 millimeters and that comes out to be 9.8 inches so I'm supposed to put this like here where they meet and come back so 9.8 is like just roughly around here so I'm going to mark that with these little Arrows. So I marked the A position on here, which comes out to right here, if you can see the arrow or not. So anyway, um, next we're going to go 700 millimeters, which comes out to be 27 and a half inches. So we mark from the first arrow and come out here to 27, and that's where we'll put our next arrow. Well now that the 
arrows have been marked on here. Line up your little arrow on the foot pad here and unscrew this screw. Maybe. Yeah. And drop it on the ground. Okay. Now, take this foot pedal here, open your door. You're going to use this screw in here. That's going to go in there. Make sure your clip is under the windowsill here and tighten down your screw. And now give the whole thing a little shake. Make sure nothing moves. After that's done, it's time to lock the system up. Just put your cap over here. Maybe. There we go. Turn your key. And there you go. Done. All right, well there we have it. I've now installed the rack on top of the roof. Looks quite nice. Looking forward to putting things on here. Making life a little bit easier.